welcome back to Pen Jammin' with Spicy Pickle Panda on Project Express. And in this episode, we're going to alter our mood a little into a realm of focus. Brought to us by Heirloom, Adjust Your Altitude. We got this at Aspire Cannabis in Ithaca, New York. You're going to be seeing us get a lot of stuff from that place because it's legal and legit. Uh, but we'll talk about that more as the reviews progress. And why we've kind of made the decision to stop going to gas stations and smoke shops. But again, we might just make a video separate from that or stay tuned. But on um, with the review. We got a 375 milligram total, 75% by volume, total THCV. That's right, THCV. We'll talk more about that on the break. 18%. Total terpenes, 5% by volume. Exposure, or, or sorry, expire, use by 126.25. So we got a little minute, but we're not waiting. Uh, lot number, all that fun stuff. On the back, instructions, inhale for three to five seconds, wait at least 30 seconds between puffs. That's that's a first. Store vertically and at room temperature, always away from light. And we always know to do that, but if you didn't, now you do. Uh, this product contains cannabis and THC. Keep out of the reach, of course, plants, or plants. Keep out of the reach of kids and animals. It is a plant. Uh, lifted, grounded, apparently. Uh, we're looking at more of a lifted sorry if we can't get all the focus to work for us but um pretty much spilling everything that's on the package anyway we got this uh trifecta this three count this one two three combo the thc it's not no more cali road sign new york road sign or we'll think of something new york 21 code scan that up but enough for the previews on the feature let's get it open i like the packaging it's different i've never had one in like a yeah, tube, if you will. But it's got a neat little celly-like wrap on it. I'm not really sure how to... It's perforated. Ooh, yep. Yeah. Get rid of that. And pop the top. I'm assuming you just... Oh, twist in a line. So I'm going to like tear right into it. Line it up. Ooh, yeah. And there it is. I'm gonna pull the cap off first. And maybe I'll be able to get a little better grip on it and get it out of there because it's in there. Oh, it said grab the cap and twist. Come on. Okay. <laughs> there it goes. Yeah, you gotta you gotta give it a little bit of a pull to get it out of there. It is really on there. Got the uh, the mini charge. Ain't seen that in a while. Make sure I didn't loosen anything while we were pulling it out of there but it's really bright but it says adjust your altitude on the side this is half of a gram quite the little draw back from our usual but then again <clears throat> This has been tested, and there's no parasites. It's legal, at least on a state level. They're working on that federal level end of things. But I feel a little bit safer knowing that it's legit. Well, let's take a poll of the uh, focus mood from Heirloom. Okay, we have thoughts. That's an interesting mix of um, um, flavors going on in there. Wow, I don't even know where to begin. Probably gonna have to take another pull off that and really mop up those uh, molecules in the old mouth there. I don't wanna say woodsy necessarily. I wanna say, right off the bat, I wanna say without uh, doing too much thought. It's minty, but citrusy at the same time. I don't know. We're going to go on for another pull. <coughs> mm. I don't know. I mean, I, I wanted to go with minty first, and now I'm getting kind of more of a, a sweeter 
flavor. Hmm. So far I'm liking it. There's a nice clean draw, uh, not too harsh, not too hot, not too cold. You know, got a good temp set in on that, I feel, right out the gate. Good hardware is always hard to find and always nice to have. But, you know the deal, we're going to pull on this for as long as it takes, and when it's all gone, we're going to come back and talk about it. And we're back with the Heirloom Mood for Focus. It has been a hot minute since we shot the first part of this video. I think it was in April, it was around the same time that I was getting the other Heirloom products. And this one, you know, tasted good. You know, it definitely, definitely gave you that big boost of energy. And uh, that's what I'm gonna mainly talk about on this recap. Um, I didn't use a lot of it, as you can see, and that's because I really didn't need to. On the... And on those days when I would have a little trouble, you know, getting going, I would, you know, get going with a pull off of this. And it only really took one, and it sharpened me right up like a stone. Like, it, it just sent me blissfully on my way to work but anyway it definitely does that so when it comes to focus I have to admit that it has that there but with that being said I'm not huge for sativas a lot of them don't really give me that energy that I kind of expect and most people get from them so this thing kind of just it hung out for quite a while as you can see and I've only used maybe like half of it maybe a little more than half of it uh, depending on you know your half full half empty perspective but it is good i would recommend it if you like that straight on focus like a beam uh you're getting it done energy this has it but for me necessarily i i don't need that unless it's like i didn't get a lot of sleep and coffee's not gonna do it for me and the regular you know cannabis uh medicine in the morning would more than likely put me back to sleep than to get me going so kudos on that they have a bunch of other products uh, edibles sodas uh, things of that nature we're thinking about trying to get a hold of some of those in the near future and and test them out but right now we'll jump on a preview and this is going to be a unboxing here momentarily more products from elegant this is the uh, ben and berries hybrid we're going to be doing a uh, taste test slash slash initial potency unboxing so look out for that until next time, this is Spicy Pickle Panda asking you to like, subscribe, hit that bell so you're notified when we post new videos. Peace out.